Previously, we had glued the fins onto the uh, fin can, and uh, now we can put our fin fillets on. So I'm taking my shims out. I'll save those for the booster stage. Uh, yeah, the fins are nice and dry, and they're nice and strong. But uh, these fin fillets uh, will make sure that uh, they are really attached. Um, to put them on, it's pretty easy. You just run a bead of glue along the joint. And then you're going to smooth it out with your finger. It's like way too much glue, but... Um, so then you have a paper towel handy because you're going to wipe off a lot of it. And just bring your finger and just smooth it out. Um, if you have too much, just wipe it off. Uh, always, always try to get that front edge. A little bit too much there. This one probably don't have enough. Need a little bit more right there. All right, and then you'll also want to lay this horizontal while it's drying. Um, if you put it like this, it's all going to run down. So let's just lay it horizontal. Um, also put a fillet on the uh, launch lug itself. So that one looks good. And now we'll go on to the next step, which is step 35 is taking the shot cord. And on each end, we want a two inch long loop. So, um, so just take it and loop it over like this and then just tie an overhand knot in it. And you want this loop here to be about two inches long. And the reason is we need it long enough that we can pass the nose cone through um, or the body tube through. Oops, got some glue on there. Take that off. Um, the body tube is probably a better one because you got that launch lug on there and it's got to fit over the launch lug at two, just like that. That looks good. You want to do that on both ends. Uh, just make sure it's long enough to go over that launch lug so it can slide over it. Just like that. So that one is good. All right. So now to attach these to the rocket, what you'll do is you'll just pass the shock cord loop through the loop on the nose cone and then take the other end and you're going to pass that through like that. And then you'll just cinch it tight. Um, and this is going to go the same way. Um, I probably should have done the, the bottom one first. Um, it'll go through the tube. So then through the loop on the uh, front of the eBay board.
and then take the nose cone and put it on the tube that will help all right so then we got the nose cone we're going to slide that through like that and then pull this tight just like that so now we got the nose cone attached to the rocket um, and then this would go inside so just kind of loop it up just there like that so now our nose cone is attached um, and that gets you through step 37 all right um, and then the next thing will be the parachute, which is step 38, and I don't have them here, but we're going to skip that and we're going to install our electronics first, which is step number 39. Um, so we'll do that in the next episode. So I'm going to let this dry. Um, and you can also, if you need to work ahead, you can start working on the booster, um, because that can be done in parallel while this is all drying.